Hello. Hi. What up? Welcome back to my channel if you're new, welcome. How's your day going, your night going? I hope everything is awesome. So tonight's video is all about this super creepy chain letter. Uh, chain letters have always creeped me out and I've, I used to believe, like, I used to believe something bad would happen. But now I just like, whatever. I don't, you know, I don't believe anything will happen. I feel like, yeah. Anyway, just want to warn you before you keep watching that it is thought that you will die if you hear the story. Not hear the story, if you read the story, I don't know, you think whatever you want. Because, like, I get mad when I watch a video. I used to get mad when I watched a video of someone telling me a scary, a cursed story. And then I would be scared out of my mind. So, for instance, if someone told me a story and said that uh, in seven days something bad would happen. Like, those seven days would be torture for me, you know? Because they just believe in it so much. So yeah, you've been warned. If you don't feel comfortable, you can click out this video. I totally understand. But what I think, if this is true, you won't get cursed because I'm the one reading it. So if someone's going to get cursed, that would be me. But yeah, you do what you feel comfortable doing. Uh, I totally understand. But yeah. Before we get started, though, I just want to say that if you're new here, hello, posting videos every week. I would love if you could go ahead and subscribe and become part of this little Spooky Bell fam. Also, hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. And yeah, also, too, I wanted to show you this. <laughs> I feel like every video, no, will be of me just like talking about my shop. I'm just excited, you know? I've never had a shop before. But yeah, uh, the super cute choker is now available on my Etsy shop. So yeah, go ahead and check that out. The link will be in the description below. Okay, so this chain letter is all about this person. I think this boy, I don't know much. I'm just gonna read it. Like, I haven't read it yet, obviously. And it is sad that if you read this, something bad will happen to you, I think, in a few days. I don't know. But yeah, I'm a little scared, even though I don't believe in that kind of stuff. And of course, I'm in a party before. And yeah, by the looks of it, it seems pretty creepy. So yeah, I'm excited for that. If you want to hear this creepy chain letter, just go ahead, turn off your lights, and stick around. Okay, so the chain letter is called i am teddy okay so i'm gonna start now if you don't feel comfortable just click out the video i've warned you like three times now okay so uh, okay hi i'm teddy once you read this you cannot get out finish reading this until it is done as i said i am teddy i am seven years old i have no eyes and blood all over my face i am dead if you don't send this to at least 12 people, I will come to your house at midnight and I'll hide under your bed like this when you're asleep and I'll kill you. Don't believe me? Case one, Patty Buckles got this email. She doesn't believe in chain letters. Well, foolish Patty. She was sleeping when her TV started flickering on and off. Now she's not with us anymore. Ha <laughs> ha, Patty. You don't want to be like Patty, do you? Case two. George M. Simon. Simon, sorry. He used to hate chain mail, but he didn't want to die that night. He sent it to four people. Not good enough, George. Now George is in a coma. We don't know if he'll ever wake up. Ha ha, George. Ha <laughs> ha. Now do you want to be like George? Oh my god, this is so creepy. Case three. Valerie Tyler, she got this letter. Another chain letter she thought only had seven people to say, sorry, she only had seven people to send it to. That night when she was having a shower, she saw Bloody Mary in the mirror. It was the biggest threat of her life. Case four, Derek Mintz. This is the final case I'll tell you about. Well, Derek was a smart person. He sent it to 12 people. Later that day, he found a 100. <laughs> Sorry, I'm shouldn't be laughing. He found a 100 dollar bill on the ground. He was promoted. No, he was promoted to head officer. What? At his job, and his girlfriend said yes to his proposal. Pro proposal. Who wrote this? 
I'm sorry. Now, Katie and him are living happily ever after. They have two beautiful children. Send it to at least 12 people, or you face the consequences. If you send it to zero people, you will die tonight. One to six people, you will be injured. Seven to 11, you will get the biggest fright of your life. Twelve and over, you are safe and you will have good fortune. Do what Teddy says. Hurry. You must send it to 12 people before midnight. Okay. What the fuck was that? I'm sorry, Teddy. I'm not trying to make fun of you, but... What the hell was that? I thought it was going to be scary. I mean, the beginning was kind of scary, but then when he started talking about Bloody Mary and shit... <laughs> Okay, it was, it was scary. I'm gonna send it to 12 people just in case, cause that's who I am. <laughs> what do you think? I've ever heard of this curse, this urban legend before, this chain letter thingy. Cause I have not. By the looks of it, it seems scary. And the name, like, the name of the urban legend was scary. Let me know your thoughts. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you have an awesome day or night. And if you're new here again, I'm saying, please do subscribe. Because I upload videos every week. I think that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you two in the next video. Bye.